when we started, I was mentioning this problem in biology. What is the unit of selection? What is the organism? What is the individual? And when you look at it from different lenses, you end up seeing a lot of cells or you see organs or you see individuals or you see societies or ecosystems of the biosphere. And all of them are in some sense valid. The interesting part here is we also have coordination going on on the different levels, sometimes between the levels too. My body functions relatively well because there is coordination in the form of hormones and other things uh, regulating it. Similarly, a society might function well because you have, for example, a high degree of trust, which is a social emotion based on individual experiences and culture. But you also, on top of that, have various formal systems that are interactive with that and allowing us to have big markets, scale things up, etc. Now, these coordinative systems, they might also be what we talk about as good so, you know, successor in some sense. We want not just to have new entities showing up, but we want the coordination between the levels and on the each level to function well. If we get super intelligence, we want it to continue our values, continue our civilization in some sense. But we also want to have a coordinative system. The worthy successor project involves in figuring out what are the nature of good coordinative and the solutions. And if we look here at how systems work, it's partially dependent on the domain. In some domains, a single mistake will kill you. So you need to be very cautious. You need to be very risk averse.